Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So, today we are at Leamington Road Dental Practice, which is just over there. And basically, I am here to get my spark aligner. So I'm gonna start my teeth aligner journey. And basically, um, I've been a couple of times already, so I've had a normal like dental checkup to check my teeth hygiene and whatnot. That went absolutely fine. Um, I also came for, um, we did scans of my teeth, um, and then I came back again and they showed me the scans, they taught me through what they're going to do, how they're going to move my teeth, so like basically showed me what they'll look like, um, and I think, oh, and they also removed my tooth jam, if you've been here a while, you'll know I had a tooth jam on, lol, <laughs> but um, yeah, so they do do tooth jams here if anyone wants one, but yeah, so I got that taken off as well, so I've been a few times, they're always really friendly, so... Yeah, I'm gonna go in there, gonna get my aligners. I'm a bit nervous. So this is my teeth before. I don't know if you can see them very well, but I'll obviously, I'll upload the proper before and after at the end of the video um, when they're done. So yeah, so excited. Let's go and get some spark aligners. Okay guys, so what they're doing here is basically putting the attachments on my teeth. So I don't know what, that they're made of but basically they put these little bits on your teeth um which is what the aligner like clicks into um it didn't hurt or anything um they probably did a few other things while they were doing it but not too sure um but yeah they put them on and then they just explained to me like how to use my aligners when to change them how to take them in and out um yeah exciting okay the aligners are in the attachments are not a vibe but i feel like i'll get used to them I feel like I'm talking a bit funny, but again, we'll get used to it. So they gave me a little bag with um, the boxes for them, for the aligners. And then I think three more sets of aligners. Yeah. Three more sets. And then these things that you bite down on. And then this thing, which I think is to help get them out. So I've got a line on my head from the chair. So I'll keep you updated on the vlogs on my spark aligners journey. So it's at... Leamington Road Dental Practice. The Instagram is Leamington Road Dental Practice. I'd really recommend them. Really good. Um, <laughs> lol. So, yeah, this is the two. This is the victim, the one that we want to move the most. So, yeah, I need to take this out now because I want to eat lunch. Hi guys. So I am one week into my Invisalign. Well, one week and two days now, and they don't hurt anymore. So they hurt for like the first two days, um, and. Uh, it was like bearable, it would be after about six hours of having them in that it would feel like, um, it, I can't really describe it, it, it would just be like too fake, um, but, and like only on certain places, but anyway, absolutely fine now. So, we're at the gym and we're going to do a, a little mic up workout, so we're training legs today, so yeah, we've got the hip for us to set up, life hack, this hip for us to set up is the best one in this gym in my opinion. I guess it depends on how tall you are, but for me, I feel like this is the perfect height bench compared to everything else. I do wish we had, like, there's actual hip thruster benches you can get, but we don't get them. Um, so, hip thrusters, I'm just going to do my warm-up set. I'm going to just do 10 reps with 70 to warm up. Really slow and squeezy. So with your hip thrusters, you want to keep your head looking forwards. A lot of people, like, look up at the ceiling. Um, and kind of keep their line, body in line with their, with the head, but you don't want to do that. You want to keep it forwards, and you're like keeping your hips tilted underneath. So don't let yourself have a curve in your lower back. I've made some videos on that on Insta, so head over and have a look. Ooh, the bootie is on fire already. Um, but yeah, okay. Ooh, four. Okay, so what I'm going to do today on my hip thrust, I'm not going to go that heavy, but I'm going to do this superset that I love to do where, oh, I feel a bit dead. I've just done one of them, hence I'm a bit dead, but I didn't film it. So um, I'm going to do 10 full reps, and then I'm going to pulse for 10, oh, and then I'm going to hold for 10. It probably takes it out of you. So, right. I have just done one set, by the way, I swear. So I'm a bit fatigued. Oh, okay. So. I'm actually still sticking with the warm-up weight. Um, I'd normally do go up a little bit more, but there's quite a few things I want to do in my leg day today, so I'm gonna, um, I'm not gonna go too heavy on these. Right, so, keeping our head forward, let's go. 10 full reps. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and pulse at the top. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And hold two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ah, minging. I've done that for years, like, oh, I literally, I think it must have been in like a program I did maybe or something, like, oh God, I can't breathe. Literally when I was about 18, like about eight years ago. And I've just always done it since because I've always thought what a good, oh, good little workout. I like it. Okay, we're doing our hours. This is actually my second set. I did a warm up with 40. Now we're gonna do 50. Ooh, okay, I could really do with some straps for this. I have ordered some, they're on their way. Um, ooh, okay, let's go. So, stiff leg deadlifts. kickback so little hack I stand on this plate because I am too short otherwise so now my hips line up otherwise my hips are like down here and um, I'm gonna make it a bit heavier and then we shall go we'll just start with a little 25 so with this one we keep our front leg against the pad we have our back leg nice and high and then we're gonna kick through our heels, squeezing our glute, straight leg, and then slowly down. I find this one like slow and steady, and squeezy is the key. Oh. You can probably just hear me like breathing really loud. Okay. Ooh. Double sided stuff's always the worst, right? Single legged. Okay, let's go. we're gonna do some leg extensions so I don't do these every single leg day because I'm not, I'm not looking at getting massive quads you know like I'm just I'm happy with the quads how they are to be honest but every now and then I do like to stick them into my leg day because my leg day is very glute focused um so yeah it's definitely good to not completely obviously you're working your quads on lots of exercises like squats split squats leg press but Every now and then I will pop them in. I say every now and then, probably every other week. It's just not a priority for me. Anyway, let's go. do them it just gives me a reality check they are so painful that's probably because I don't put them in my routine very often oh are they popping now the quads massive yet finish off we're gonna do some single leg press um, I was hoping to do it on the other leg press but there is someone on there so I guess we're using this one so oh I absolutely hate these they take so much focus I say I hate them, but they're nice than Bulgarian split squats and they're kind of like the same thing.
Okay, last little thing. I'm just gonna have a little leg stretch. So I won't film this whole thing because you'll be quite bored watching me probably because I'm just gonna hold loads of stretches for 30 seconds. Um, but I've had a lovely leg session. It's been very fun. Um, so yeah, and the Invisalign is, well, Sparkaline. So I had a bit of confusion at first. I was like, what is Invisalign? What is Sparkaline? It's that Invisalign are just a brand of, of aligners. So these are Spark aligners. So it's just literally a different brand. So um, where I've gone, Leamington Road Dental Practice said that they used to use Invisalign and they said they had better results with this brand. So yeah, I mean, it's all the same thing. Basically, I wear the aligners. I don't know if I said this. I've got 18 aligners, they said and then I'm gonna wear them all for two weeks. So hopefully within 36 weeks, my teeth should be in like perfect position. But yeah, I barely even know that they're in now, to be honest. I feel like they're, um, I don't know, I just feel like they're barely in. So yeah, amazing. Right, I'm gonna finish my stretches and then I've got a fun rest of the day planned. So I'll bring you along with me. Hi guys, we're going roller skating today. This is my outfit of the day. Let's go. Wrap roller jam. This is massive. Very fun. Can we go here? Ooh, look at that. Very cool. this vlog um i hope you enjoyed it let me know what you thought about the mic talk workout i feel like it's a much more interesting way for me to integrate my workouts into the vlog so let me know and yeah the invisalign is going strong um this is only the next day from when i last filmed so um yeah still kind of same situation but um yeah they don't hurt i would really recommend to be fair um leamington road dental practice that is the one that i'm going to i'll keep you updated on the journey for all the vlogs anyway so yeah thanks for watching guys and i will see you next sunday bye